Hi guys, welcome back to Brianna's Rose. Like always, my name is Brianna and thank you so much for clicking on today's video. As you're watching this today, or as I'm filming I should say, I actually just came back from Epcot. It was amazing. Um, I went with some friends for my friend Alessia's birthday. Happy birthday Alessia if you're watching this. Um, and it was so much fun. I was able to watch Harmonious for the first time, which it was beautiful. It was literally like amazing. Like I literally almost started to like shed tears. That's how like I was just in awe, in awe. But while I was there, I was able to find this collectible pin um, pack that I saw online. And ever since I saw it online, I was like, okay, I want to get this. And I kind of have been like holding off. It's on Shop Disney. But then when I was at the park and I actually saw them there, I was like, it was literally the last bag. I was like, okay, I have to get this. So basically, they are these Disney coffee cups that are inspired by Disney characters. So just a few, there's a 16 different ones that you can collect and just a few that I am hoping are in this bag are the mini, the Belle of course, that's my girl. Um, the Tinkerbell I would love. Really they're all super cute. So I don't think I'll be disappointed with any of these, but yeah, definitely the Belle and the Tinkerbell would be, oh, and the Rapunzel. Oof, okay, like I said, definitely the, the Belle is the goal here. We want Bell in here. So in a pack, it comes with five different pins and this retails for $29.99. But yeah, let's just hope that we got some good ones in this because it is definitely a little pricey, but I feel like if you do get five that you like, it ends up being a good value because the pins come out to less than a regular pin. But yeah, so. Let's go ahead and put in some good energy into the world. Let's go ahead and open this up. So, okay, we're going to get at least one. It's going to be dull. So, I don't think they come wrapped. I'm not sure. Here's one. Yeah, I'm trying to see if I can feel. I don't think they're wrapped. So, I'm not going to try to look down. But, oh, no, they actually are wrapped. So, they come in these little baggies. So we should have five of these. Let's so just go ahead and make sure. Okay, so we have one, two, three, four, five. Okay, moment of truth. This is actually the first like big pack of mystery pins that I've done. Um, the largest quantity that I've opened is like two per pack. So that I can remember, but okay, let's do this. Let me know in the comments if you've already opened these up and who you got. I just thought this was like such a cool idea. The coffee cups. Okay. Okay, I don't know who this is. Not off to an amazing start. Let's see. Uh, hmm. Okay, first of all, on a positive note, these pins are big. So they're not like very tiny. So definitely great value or great starting off. Good start. I don't know what this is though. Is it, is, oh, wait, yes. This is Hades, is it Hades? I see like the blue fire at the bottom. So I think this is Hades. Let me know if you know. Okay, next one. We have, oh, we have Bambi. I think this is Bambi. Some of them are a little bit more obvious at least for me, to call out. Oh, but this one's cute with the little butterfly and the flowers. Okay, this one I like. This one, super cute. Okay, that's already two down. We have three more to go. I need Belle. I need Belle. Okay, let's see. Oh, cute. Okay, this one, I love this one. This one's figment. So it has the rainbow and the clouds and it's just like, now that I think about it, actually, while we were at Epcot, we wanted to do, well, I wanted to do the Figment ride and we never got to it. And I just remembered, I forgot the park, but you know, there's just so much to do. Like Epcot is like so much, like so many different things going on with like the booths and the rides and it, it can be a lot. We were there for like the whole entire day and we still didn't get to do like everything that we wanted to do. But this one's super cute. Okay, ooh, okay, let's see. Okay, I don't like this one. This is Chesh Cheshire Cat from Alice in Wonderland. 
That one's a little creepy. I know it's like a little bit of a joke, like not everybody always likes the Cheshire Cat ones. I feel like they're either like a hardcore fan of the Cheshire, I can't even say it, cat, or you're kind of like, you just don't like him at all. I feel like there's no in between. I might be wrong, but. Okay, so let's see. This is our last one. So, could it be Belle? No. Why would it be Belle? Why would I get, why would I get what I want, right? <laughs> it's Pinocchio, which this one's actually very, very cute. That is adorable. Um, so we didn't get any of the ones that we wanted, which is a little disappointing because this pack was very expensive. <laughs> but this was super fun. Uh, I don't know. Actually, not that I don't know. I definitely wouldn't purchase it again to try to get the bell. Um, so I'm definitely going to be on the lookout for bell or for anyone. So my favorite would be the Figment, the Pinocchio, and the Bambi. Those are the three that I would probably keep. Um, let me know in the comments which one was your favorite. Um, and if you did open this pack and you see one that you need and you have like a Belle or a Rapunzel or a Minnie Mouse or really any other ones of the ones that I got, let me know as well. Um, so yeah, I would have to overall say that this unboxing wasn't the most successful, but did we have fun while opening it? Yes. <laughs> have I been wanting to open these for a very long time? Um, ever since I saw them online? Yes. So we did what we wanted to do. Remember, let me know what your favorite pin was in the comments. Um, this was fun. So thank you so much again. Hope you guys have a great day, a magical week, and I'll see you next time. Bye. <laughs>